Hey guys, I'm back, and I know I've slacked off, and we've been talking about giant robots and stuff, but when it comes down to it, I had to do my research, because this has got to be, oh, just, you won't believe it until you see it, okay? Anyway, let's let's do titles, and then I'll explain everything. Just, just go, you guys read titles. Hey guys, I'm back. And uh, I know I've been doing new videos kind of differently and stuff like that because I finally got a new laptop and that means that I've got new editing software but I'm still kind of fiddling with it. So just uh, humor me with this when I did it old school like we always did. Okay, so you read what the title was, Defenders of Space, right? Now, when I found this, I'm going to tell you why. I only paid a dollar. Just a dollar. So I knew I wasn't getting anything great out of it, right? Okay, so I take this thing home, and I pop it in the old DVD player. This is where we lived across town at the first house. And I got my pajamas, and got all ready and everything, and it was like, all right, let's watch this. And then it just fell apart. Just all fell apart. That's right, your stinker movie of the week is another anime, an anime I bet you've never seen. And if you can find this on Netflix, I'll salute you personally if you'll let me know. And that's Defenders of Space. Try to get it up here, which I know you guys can probably see it. It's hard to see on my little screen here, but I want you guys to get a full cover shot. I'll even show you the back, because you may recognize somebody you see there. You may also recognize him if you look at the front one more time, especially if you're a big Transformers fan like me. And that is the robot you see in there and in the center photo on the back. And that's Inferno from the Transformers, but... This has nothing to do with the Transformers. I really thought maybe this was some lost something that I... That I... Okay, here's what I do know, okay? This is called Defenders of Space, and it was imported over here. Also, parts of this were used to make something called Space Kids, I believe. Anyway, I bought it for a dollar from a retail store that no longer sells it, along with some other cheap animes that I have no idea what they are. But anyway, the thing that it brought me back to, of course, is the fact that that's Inferno. So is this guy right here. That's Inferno from the first Transformers generation. And so I started watching it, and all of a sudden, they, 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 it's it's about some kids that have to save the world from some evil robot or some evil <laughs> robots that are uh, owned by some evil aliens. The problem is, is that every time they do something in this movie, which I think might have been a series turned, it, I don't know, it's crap. Point being is, is that everything in this film is a ripoff. The only thing original in this film that I can understand is this is the first time that this Inferno, or this robot we all know as Inferno, or some of us do, this is the first time an animated version of that toy ever existed. It even transforms in the show just like the toy did. I know, I owned one when I was like six. The other thing is, this is currently known as the biggest ripoff anime of all time. Defenders of Space. It has everything in it from every series that was going on at the time. You got giant robots. You got good robots. You got space battles. You got aliens in cylindrical spaceships. You got aliens that have blue like skin and certain features are, are either larger or smaller or whatever. Then you have the princess of the bad guys who looks just as white as I am, if not whiter, trust me. And they, <laughs> the main emperor of the bad guys, guys, is named Nick. Yeah, you didn't hear me wrong. I said Nick. It's either Emperor Nicholas or Nick. Or the evil Nick. What the hell? All the rest of the bad guys have, like, bad guy alien names that you could think up of. You know, and say, oh, that's, yes, that's a good name for a bad guy. Let's make the general that guy. Nick. Nick. Oh, let me put an annotation right here. There. Right there. Yeah. Nick. Nick. So I spent too long on the Nick thing, I understand. Anyway, uh, a group of kids trying to save the world from evil aliens bent on destroying it with a leader named Nicholas or Nick or whatever. And when I first watched this, I thought, though, this is really, really bad Japanese anime. No, it's South Korean. South Korean. Right here. You know what the worst part about it is? I'm not even joking. Like, we seriously, I got other DVDs stored in here. Let's just... Here, okay, we've watched it. That's crap. 
Okay. Now you think when they made the disc, they would try to make the disc a little bit more, I don't know, something not to laugh at, right? All right, now if you have small children, you may want to cover their eyes because this is a little bit graphic. Ready? Do you see what I'm seeing here? Do you see what I'm seeing here? I hope you're seeing this. I know I, I know you can, but just, um, what? I'm not even going to pull that out again. That, that that was too much for me the first time I noticed it. Let me get all this. I just have it curled up with another DVD to just, well, anyway. Well, that was your uh, stinker for the week, <laughs> Defenders of Space. Don't check it out. Don't even try. But if you can find this on Netflix, let me know in the comments below. And uh, I will personally give you a salute on the air the next time we go around for being such a fan. Um... Please stay tuned. My vlog will be up in the next couple of days. I hope I've had so much trouble at work. We've had so many hours that we've had to work. They've done all kinds of stuff to us, and I'm trying so hard to get these videos out. Anyway, bad movie for the week. I'll find you one to watch. I promise it's better than this. Thanks, guys. Remember to uh, thumbs up the video, comment below, comment if you can find it on the, uh, Netflix. Rate and subscribe if you want to. You know how to subscribe, guys. You've all been here before. Anyway, it's me. Please don't watch this crappy piece of junk. Be seeing you.